hello guys welcome to mr legend crypto guys in this video we'll be taking a look at an all coin solana currently trading below ten dollars how low will solana go in the bear market we have seen solana dumping from goblin town after setting an all-time high of 260 dollars in november 2021 2022 was a brutal year for solana solana is currently down 96.89 percent from that all-time high is it safe to start buying some Solana right now or should we wait for Solana to continue dumping to Goblin Town? Solana has lost more than 20% of its value in the last one week. It's currently down 28% in the last one year. If Solana continues dumping to Goblin Town, how low can we possibly go? Is the dump over? In this video, we'll be looking at the Solana US dollar price chart and what's next for Solana in the coming weeks and the coming months. We'll also be looking at Solana's performance against Ethereum, Solana's performance against Bitcoin, and then we'll take a look at Solana's market cap. Solana's market cap has dropped pretty low, dropping to as low as $3.5 billion, the lowest we have seen Solana's market cap since March 2021. Will Solana's market cap continue dumping to Goblin Town? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, when it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. And investment in knowledge pays the best interest. So if you want to make money long time trading or investing in cryptocurrencies, if you want to get the latest crypto news, price predictions, and chart analysis, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Let's get down to business. One, two, three, four, five. Solana has been dropping pretty low in the last one week. Solana has been dropping to Goblin Town in the last one week, losing more than 21% of its value. It lost more than 28% of its value in the last one month. In the last one year, Solana is down pretty bad. Solana was one of the huge gainers in the bull run. We saw Solana pumping to the moon in the 2020-2021 bull run. And those people that invested in Solana went to trading around the $0.5. Those people that invested in Solana when it was trading around a $0.55 level in May 2020 were happy they did because all they had to do was hold on to their Solana bag and in a matter of 540 days, they saw their Solana bag go up more than 45,000%. $1,000 invested in Solana at the $0.55 level returned over $455,000 by November 2021. But anything that goes up very, very quickly has a very strong chance of coming down very, very quickly. And after the bull market comes the bear market. And right now, Solana is going through a bear market. But guys, good news is that I believe we are closer to the bottom than we are to the top. If Solana drops to the $4 level, that's just a 50% decline from where we are right now. We have seen Solana steadily dump into Goblin Town. We stayed 2022 with Solana trading above the $160 region. But in 2022, we have seen Solana dump to Goblin Town, losing more than 95% of its value in one year. If Solana continued on Pit Goblin Town in 2023, I expect 2023 to be a year where Solana will find its bottom. So at some point in time, 2023, we'll see Solana dumping to Goblin Town and maybe finding its bottom. Right now, we're closer to the bottom than we are to the top. We've even seen Solana got into as low as $7.93 in the bear market. There's a lot of food going around in the market. A lot of people are saying you're not going to touch Solana till it gets to zero. I can understand your perspective because all coins, as they're dumping to Goblin Town, they can keep dumping to Goblin Town. In the case of Solana, if we don't find any support pretty soon, we might see Solana heading to the $4.66 level. But guys, nobody knows the exact bottom and nobody knows the exact top. And right now, the bottom might probably be in for Solana. It's normal for us to see all coins lose more than 96% of their value from their all time highs after the bull market ends. But guys, it's also normal for us to see those all coins recover those gains and maybe even set new all time highs by the end of the next bull run. And if you want to be profitable by the end of the next bull run, right now, deep in the bear market is where you want to be making those moves. Remember, the fact that you're buying these all coins doesn't mean they can't keep dumping to Goblin Town. But ultimately, you want to dollar cost average through the process because in some years' time, you'll be wishing you bought Solana when it was in single digits. We saw this happen to Ethereum. Ethereum went to $1,400 and Ethereum dumped back to $80. A lot of people thought Ethereum was dead. Ethereum went from $80 to $4,800. So I'll not be shocked to see Solana pumping above $1,000 by the end of the next bull run. Yes, a huge backup of Solana network, Sam Beckman Fried has been arrested. But guys, the technology doesn't change. Solana still has NFTs. Solana still has an ecosystem. And when all the dust settles, you'll be seeing Solana rallying up to higher prices and everybody else realize it was just all fought. 
right now there's extreme fear in the market right now there's extreme pessimism in the market and that's the best time to invest if you believe in the project if you believe in what the developers at solana are doing right now you want to take in close look at solana us dollar price chart now if you take a look at solana's performance against both bitcoin and ethereum in the prediction video for 2023 i told you guys i expect solana to continue dumping to goblin town against both bitcoin and both ethereum why do you expect that to happen for Solana in the coming weeks and the coming months? Is because we're in the face of the bear market, where a lot of people will now be scared to touch all coins. People will be comfortable to touch Bitcoin and Ethereum because that has stood the test of time. Right now, Solana is very, very dangerous, and Solana has been dumping since September 2021 when it topped against Ethereum. It's currently down its 8.86 percent. I'll not be shocked to see further downsides for Solana against Ethereum, but right now it looks as if we are due some pumps to the upside. Maybe nothing crazy, we might just see Solana rally up against Ethereum. Maybe it might even do that against Bitcoin. We're seeing it dumping to Goblin Town. We we'll see a small rally against Bitcoin for Solana. But ultimately, in 2023, let's not be shocked to see Solana drop into lower valuations against both Bitcoin and Ethereum. There's a lot of fear in the crypto market right now and when people are scared they run towards safety and right now people are scared and you can see them right now you can see them fleeing solana for some bitcoin and for some ethereum so will you be among the crowd or will you be doing opposite of what the crowd is doing just like how people are flipping their bitcoin for some solana at the top right here is the same way some people are flipping their solana for some bitcoin and in the future, when we see Solana pumping to the moon, those sets of individuals are going to run back trying to get into Solana because we are pumping to the moon. If you take a look at Solana's RSI on the 3 day time frame, you can see that the RSI showing us that we're in the oversold region. It doesn't mean the bottom is in, it just means we're in values where a lot of people are doing a lot of selling. So maybe just maybe in 2023, we'll see Solana rally up to the upside. What will that mean for the price? Are we going to break into new all-time highs? Probably not, but we might see Solana rally back up to the $29, $30 region before the end of 2023. If you take a look at what Solana did in the last one year, we saw Solana go from as high as $179 to as low as $8.14. Currently ranked 17 on coin market cap, Solana was among the top 10 cryptocurrencies by market capitalization for majority of the bull run. Right now, over 1.7 million people still have Solana on their watch list. Solana has a market cap of $3.5 billion and a fully directed market cap of $1.5 billion. Solana has a circulating supply of 367 million souls. Where can you get some Solana? If you want to get some in the bear market, getting ready for the next bull run, you can get some Solana on Binance, on Coinbase Exchange, on Qcoin, on Kraken, on Bitfinex, and guys, anywhere you get your popular altcoins, you can get some Solana right there. Now, if you take a look at Solana's market cap, we have gone below the line in the sand we talked about in the previous video. We're looking at Solana holding that $4 billion level in its market cap chart. Right now, we have seen Solana's market cap even drop to as low as $3 billion. Maybe just maybe 2023 is the year we see Solana bottoming out. But if Solana doesn't find the bottom pretty soon, we might see Solana's market cap heading first to that $2.5 billion region. And hopefully, the $2.5 billion region holds. If not, we might be heading further down to Goblin Town. From where Solana is trading right now, for us to see it head back to that $2.5 billion region on its market cap chart, Solana will have to drop another 29 to 30%. What will that mean to the price of Solana if we see it dropping 20 to 30 percent from where we are currently trading right now? Solana's price will go below seven dollars, maybe even getting to as low as 6.5 dollars. Will you be buying some Solana if we see it trading around the 6.5 dollar region, or will you be waiting for lower prices? At what price do you think Solana will bottom right now in the bear market? Guys, drop your thoughts in the comment section. Where do you see the altcoin market heading to in 2023? Do you think we're going to continue dumping to Goblin Town and 2023 will be bearish like 2022? Or are we going to catch a rally to the upside in 2023? Drop your thoughts about that in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notifications to get notified anytime I drop a new video. See you guys in my next video.